Welcome back, Horlings, to more sanitarium. An empty copper bowl. You've been it must have been used for sacrifice. Running around the town doing nice things for these people. The wind totem. Rescuing little children. Trying not to step on the dead bodies. Look at this poor guy here. He's got the rock just bashed in his head. It's a shitty way to go right there. Does this noble warrior seek? He's like floating and disappearing and shit. Spirit, what say you? Litter to meet first to Rome. What name did you go by in this world, fallen hero? The shaven head Otonmi? Yes! Savage destroyers! What was your station as warrior spirit? In my prime, older than Tivitak, younger than Utsala. Images carved in stone. Somehow these hold the key to the water temple. That's how they hold the key to the water temple. Hello. The water totem. I got about a water totem. Preparing for battle? Old man, what say you? I say that the end is near. Quetzalcoatl will destroy us all, lest I find one who can bring me the pawn of might. What name do you go by, Ancient One? My name is Tezekatl. I am the village's last hope. It is my duty, as village witch, to destroy this devil who plagues us. What is this pod you speak of? The sacred pod of might. It contains the seeds I require to finish my spell. Yet, there is no way to reach it. Why is that? It clings to the joining tree, surrounded by liquid fire. Not even your stone form could withstand it. What the hell was that? How does the tree survive if it is surrounded by fire? It is magic, 
as is the pod that grows on its mighty trunk. However, the magic is fading, and the limbs will soon wither and burn. There must be some way to reach it. Perhaps the ancient rite of the warrior may be the answer. Rite of the warrior? What will that old magic accomplish? It is old indeed, wise one. Though not practiced for many generations, it is rumored to have the ability to make a warrior impervious to the elements. Then I will go through the trials. Perform it. Forgive me, sacred one. I cannot. I don't remember the complete ceremony. However, the stonemason knows it. He is the village chief now, and is over at the huts. What spell are you preparing? It is called the Spirit Fire. It creates a mystic energy wave formed by the souls of the dead. Why do you sit here, idle in the village instead of fighting? What kind of coward are you? Harsh words, your holiness. But I am not merely sitting here. I am meditating to gain the power needed to combat his awful magic. I see the temples are nearly destroyed by Quetzalcoatl's dark magic. Yes, the totems may be in grave danger. What totems are you speaking of? The statues sheltered within the temples. These statues represent the purity of the gods themselves. I believe Quetzalcoatl fears them, else why would he seek to destroy them? How do you expect to defeat a god, little man? I don't. He is very strong. I cannot possibly hope to defeat him. However, if I anger him enough with my spell, he will spend precious energy on me. That should sufficiently weaken him enough for you to defeat him. You would sacrifice yourself for the village? It must be done. Your wife mourns for you, witch. She knows what I plan and fears the future without me. She has seen our two warrior sons die at the hands of Quetzalcoatl, and soon she will bury me. I'm gonna throw Quetzi Nut Kogel in the volcano. Being such a D bag. I have found your daughter, Mason. It is time for me to undergo the rite of the warrior. You are truly honorable, Olmec. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. I should never have doubted you. Enough groveling, chieftain. Get on with it. Y yes, of course. There are two stages to the ritual. The first, an act of bravery and heroism. You've already shown that by returning my daughter to me. Second, you must recite the names of the warriors who have come before you in order of their lineage. That's why we've been talking to them all. Let's get it done. I'd like to undergo the second stage of the ritual. Do you know all six names of the warriors who came before you? Yes, I do. Then let us begin, Olmec. Name the six warriors, starting with the youngest and ending with the eldest. Zilunen. Ometok. Tipetok. Sentiotl. Huitzilop. Mixquartal. You are most wise, Grand Olmec. You are now ready for the ancient magics of the land, handed down to me by my father and his father before him. To protect you from the mighty elements, I must combine your stone flesh with my blood 
and the magics of the earth. This will create a temporary magical barrier between yourself and the forces of nature. How long will it last? Not long. You must be swift in your quest. Blood of the holy, flesh of the warrior, married to the heart of the land in a union of protection and power. Hear my prayers for divine conjuring. Bring forth the sacred magics of the deep earth to shield this noble warrior from the harsh elements. It is done. Go forth and fulfill your destiny, Olmec. The fate of our village lies in your hands. This must be the Pod of Might. The Pod of Might. Another hut. The air around it smells of magic. This. I have the pot of might, old one. Here, work your magic. Very good. Thank you, sacred one. I will begin at once. I go to fulfill my destiny. May my sacrifice save the village. Although honorable in your sacrifice, the village is still in danger, old one. Quetzalcoatl has powerful magic at his disposal. M mask. Mask? What mask do you speak of? Death mask. His power c comes from it. Where is it? Below the maze. <sighs> Which doctor's corpse? His blood flows freely from wounds that will not heal. An empty. We will take some of this blood. A crystal heart. Place these two offerings in the bowls before you, 
and then you may enter the Temple of the Jaguar. Ugh. This is a noble offering, holy warrior, but it is misplaced. Okay. That's all I had to say. Holy one, this blood is sacred indeed, but still, a second offering is required. The heart which does not bleed. Find this, and the door of the temple shall open. Ugh. The offerings are accepted. The Jaguar temple door opens before sacred Omen. Hmm. Stone wheels. Set to turn for some strange purpose. God damn it. So, got this uh, little willy dilly puzzle here. And we want to do the order of the stairs Bull's Head, Mooncrest, the Infinite Sign, the Mast, the Sun, and the fish and then the target ready to kill sign that's the crescent moon infinity sign After that, we want the face. Uh, this should be a fish. The Jaguar Totem. The Jaguar's power is revealed. Oh, shit. You up, bitch. Save game. Return to game. The water tot Such an action is I can't use I can't be surely no it def surely The Jaguar The wind totem, an empty cup, the water totem. The, I can't that.
Together, you son of a bitch! Molecular cohesion affirmative. Yes! Test cycle downloaded to DVD. Encryptor sequence completed. System shutdown activated. Somebody dislocated the brakes. Welcome to the maze, bitches. Some motherfucking maze. Save game. Still chapter eight in the motherfucking maze. Don't be fucking with that pink electricity, son. This looks like a release switch. Okay, we'll fucking hit it. Or just be a goddamn stupid bastard.
trust him. That was close. God damn it, stop walking down, you stupid fuck. Oh my god. You are dumber than a shit brick house. I'm gonna punch you in your fucking stone face, you motherfucker. Peacock, petrified son of a bitch. Fucking me in the ass. I'm going to punch someone directly in the dick. I didn't go that way, I knew it was fucking blocked off. Save game. Return to game. Now go fuck your mother, bitch. Load game. Goddamn stupid Logan. fucking whore. Fucking even goddamn motherfucking possible? All of them? It ain't. Did I go in front of that one? It's gone. Wait a minute. I didn't even think about trying to get in between them. Load game. 
Like in between, in between. You stupid fucking slow motherfucker. Load game. Fantastic piece of shit level. Overbuilt, this should be stabbed in the fucking eye with a pencil. Load game. Wonder if I'll be cutting this part out. Shit, save my fucking game. That's redonkulous. Punch you right in the teeth for that fucking puzzle. Return to game. Not going that way. I will punch you in the dick. Quetzalcoatl. I'll punch you right in the man dick. This shit. Save game. Return to game. Shit, you didn't get hit that lever? This lever locks the gate in place. That is awesome. Thank you, Peacock Face. Oh, must take care of the death mask of Quetzalcoatl.
Oh, my poor baby. You had an awful fall. I'm so glad you've come home. Home? Well, of course, silly. You did want to come home, didn't you? Yes, I, I wanted to... Well, then that's that. Hush now, Max. When you fell down the chimney, you bumped your head, and now you're a little confused, that's all. My... my head hurts. I remember hitting it. That's right, dear. You hit your head on the chimney. Now don't give it another thought. I'll take care of you. Chimney? No, I... I hit it... No, I hit it on... In... My... My... Car? No, of course not, dear. You just bumped... Yes, my car! I was driving and... The brakes! But Max, we've been waiting for you for so long. Don't leave now. We? Who? Why me and little Sarah, of course. <laughs> well, who else would it be, silly? But... But that's impossible. Sarah is dead! Sarah! Max is home! Max! You're home, you're home! I missed you! You're alive! My god, Sarah! You're... No! You're dead! <laughs> What's wrong with your soul? Your tenacity is quite remarkable, you know. Your doctor tells me that you should have died in the car wreck. I wish things could have worked out differently, Max, but they didn't. You leave me little choice, old friend. Did you honestly expect me to sit by while you went public with your cure? No. I've worked much, much too hard to allow that. I guess this is goodbye, Max. I'm truly sorry it had to end like this. Farewell. Welcome to the Garnet. We'll see you in the next episode, folks, for the final... Well, it's gonna crash on me, so... Game can go fuck itself anyways.